Zwom Bima. Hello everyone and welcome to another Bimo Creative Fact About Fiction video. So this one is about sperm whales. So I'm doing this video because I uh, went to the zoo with my brother recently and he was telling me about something that he had read and I researched it and this is what I found out. So sperm whales are the largest of the toothed whales and have one of the widest global distributions of any marine mammal species inhabiting all the world's oceans. They live everywhere. So they have been recorded at sizes reaching over 50 feet long and weighing over 90,000 pounds. They usually are gray or a bluish gray, but they can have an even darker blue color, even some white spots, especially on their stomach and even a full white underbelly. Sperm whales hunt for food during deep dives that they do that can reach depths of over 10,000 feet for over an hour. Their diet consists of anything smaller than them, pretty much. Uh, squid, sharks, skates, fish, uh, rays, all, all kinds of food that occupy those deep waters as well. Uh, sperm whales consume about 3.5% of their body weight per day, which could be around 2,700 pounds of animals that they're eating. Makes them a top predator. They are one of the most dangerous creatures on the planet. And I'm not talking about their bite or their size. I'm talking about their whale song, specifically their clicks that they do before they sing. While normal human speech takes place between 60 and 65 decibels, sperm whale clicks described as clicks because they literally sound like a tack, tack, tack sound they can reach a, as high as 235 decibels. In contrast, a loud rock concert is only 115 decibels, and the sound of a jet engine at 20 yards away from you is roughly 140 decibels. Quite simply, sperm whales are the loudest animals on the planet. Such is the power of their clicks that whales can comfortably transmit information to others from hundreds of miles away and even across vast oceans. It's estimated that sperm whales can hear one another hundreds, perhaps even thousands of miles away using this technique, in fact. A sound of 180 decibels is enough to cause drastic hearing problems, can even bust your eardrum. But the most powerful sperm whale clicks will not merely deafen you. They can vibrate the human body to pieces, literally. So those movies and things that Hollywood does where they show a giant squid wrapping around a sperm whale, because we know they hunt squid, and the squid can actually drown the sperm whale sometimes, and it's this epic battle. No, sperm whale wins every time because they just make one of these clicks around their body, and poof, the squid turns into chunks, and the whale just swims through and eats it. It's pretty simple. So you heard me right, uh, whales are so loud that their clicks are capable of killing humans within their vicinity, says many, many divers. So I, I put a link in my description below for James Nestor's Facebook page where he's, he's a professional diver that has swam with sperm whales and he talks about a buddy of his that was paralyzed in part of his body, like his arm for like four hours or something and stuff like that. Um, just from being close to them and their bodies heating up from the clicks it, because it's literally vibrating you almost like a microwave or something very very dangerous clicks are so powerful in the water that they can blow out your eardrums easily and they can actually vibrate a human body to death at around 150 decibels that's what it takes to blow your eardrums and then an estimated 180 to 200 is enough to kill you. And they, they do this like constantly. They're making these click sounds. And sound travels differently underwater than it does through the air, which means those 200 dB clicks are far more amplified than they would be on land because water is denser than air. So sound in the water is measured differently on a different decibel scale. In air, the sperm whale would still be extremely loud at around 174 decibels, which is still loud enough to rupture your eardrums. Suffice to say, 
you probably don't want to swim or spend a lot of time swimming with sperm whales. Unlike what Discovery Channel or National Geographic or play, or shows like, you know, channels like that tell you, you know, oh, it's so beautiful to swim with these whales. And then they're, they're like clicking you to death, but they don't, they don't tell you that. However, I have to admit, despite these abilities, whales are extremely smart. Their brains are six times the size of ours. And they mainly use their sounds to communicate, investigate their surroundings, and navigate the big blue. They don't mean to use them lethal as lethal force on humans so anyway that's going to do it for this one guys thanks so much for watching please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to be more creative for more fact about fiction videos thanks so much